Hello everyone, it's Faded Pay here. Welcome back. This week I haven't built any new LEGO set again, so I decided to bring you another episode of my unopened LEGO Backlog Collection. And today I think it's a good time to go through my collection of Creative 3-in-1 series. To be honest, I haven't bought any of the Creative 3-in-1 in recent years just because uh, it's mostly for parts and uh, I also try to cut down my LEGO purchases. So mostly uh, from like, you know, three years before and uh, we'll take a look on what I have. Okay, so the first one over here is this one here. I really forgot uh, the name of it. I bought it because of um, one of the minifigure parts that I found very interesting back then. But obviously that part is now, you know, widely available or I can't even get it from brick and pieces. So uh, I'm not sure when I will open up this set. And then the next one here is a nice shop over here. Again, you know, bought it when uh, it's time. Try to get uh, all the cool looking Lego set. This is a really cool set and uh, uh, looks really nice as well. Uh, but again, I'm not sure if I will ever open this one. Now the next one, I will definitely keep it and open it sometime because this is when the Creative Ring one has some really awesome set. This is this uh, modern family home here with the light brick. It's a fully enclosed build and it looks really nice and I uh, really look forward to uh, build this one. The next set also I bought based on the look uh, because it's a really nice uh, looking uh, boat. Uh, moving towards the next one, this is another one that I'm not sure if I would open it. It's a really nice uh, cupcake shop, but it's a really small build. Got some really cool elements. I uh, bought it at a time again when I thought it's a really cool set to have, but right now, you know, I'm not sure if I will open this at all. But then look at the back, there's some cool, interesting build. Um, I think I will keep this one, uh, but might build something. Uh, not exactly the same, but you know, might do some original creations. Now the next one is another very cool set. It's pretty much the Pirates roller coaster, although it's a really small uh, roller coaster, but that really uh, makes sense and looks really cool. Uh, there's something that I wouldn't sell and will probably keep it, um, but I'm not sure when I will open it. But it does look really cool, and there's some really cool, um, you know, callback to the uh, classic Pirates theme. Next is uh, one small apartment. Again, this is the uh, type of set that I bought. Just, uh, you know, I can't even know <laughs> why I bought this one. Uh, pretty much uh, it's because it's a uh, nice building. So this one, I'm not sure if I'm going to open it at all. Now this is another uh, cool uh, little house build. Um, it's released a few years back. It's again a fully enclosed house. This is the type of set I will definitely keep and it looks really cool. So there's another set kind of you know container, so I need to like remove a few things before I can show you the other one. It's pretty much pretty unorganized right now. Um, but then let me just remove all this instruction and base plates so I can uh, bring out that particular set. It's nothing really special, but it's a really cool set that um, they don't release much of that before they kind of incorporate into uh, the uh, city theme this is a really cool 911 you need to find a place to properly display it you, you might notice you know some some other cool lego sets while i'm trying to take that one out which i will go through in a separate video and i just realized <laughs> This is a superhero set that I should have uh, gone through last time, but I didn't, so here you go. <laughs> There's a Justice League, um, what's that, Hero of Justice Sky High Battle. Uh, well, not Justice League, but Batman vs. Superman, which I should have you know, gone through last time, but this is the uh, final Creative 3-in-1 set that I want to show you guys, which is this uh, Camper fan here is a really cool looking set. I really like the design of it and I'm glad that I bought this one and hopefully I will build sometime this year. And this is my collection of unopened creative free one sets. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming updates and I'll see you next time.